Welcome back guys to another video. Today we're on a Lydia Egg Encounter, which means all augments this game move to random locations. I'm not a huge fan of this augment or encounter, but it is what it is. Now, I'm going to, I feel like I don't have a very good um, start, right? I have 10 gold. It's a, I'm gonna slam this. It's a uh, soft econ start with two items only. Um, I have a two star Kogma, which is nice. I think what we'll do is we will go for Exalted and play around Lilia. That's why I slammed the static shiv because um, Lilia is magic damage anyway, so we kind of want to shiv if possible, and this can save us some HP here. Early Exalted, Shen locks. So what we'll do is play Lilia and Diana. Um, very likely, I don't need this anymore. Never. Lilia, Diana, play some Invokers. Um, Dragonlord and Sage. And then whatever else we can, right? So... Actually, we could just play the Lilia Ash comp, I guess. Lilia. Ah, uh, no, not really. I was thinking about the porcelain on Lux, but I don't want to play Lux on my board, honestly. I would much rather just play Shen, and that gives us ghostly. Oh, yeah, there you go. So you play Shen, Diana, of course, Lilia, Morgana for Sage, right? Um, and Exalted then as well. This is our core comp. Nice. Oh, we win this. Okay, very good. And then we just play around this as our as our base. We can go Orn, maybe. We can play Dragon Lord. It's either Lee Sin or Rakan. I believe Rakan. Oh, play even this girl. Another bruiser. Who's a good bruiser? Oh, I mean, Galio is just a very good unit, right? And then might as well play Story Weaver. So let's play. Oh, okay, there's a girl. And I lose Dryad, but who cares? That's a Diana. Yeah, I might as well play Story Weaver, but then I can drop Lilia. Because if I play Story Weaver, I'll play probably Irelia, right? Or we look for a Story Weaver that's good. Oh, Zyra for Sage and Story Weaver. Okay, it's coming together, I guess. And then Rakan at the end, right? Something like that sounds very decent to me. Um, something to aim for this game. Ah, oh, he missed. Okay, kill. One more kill, maybe. Can we? No, not gonna happen. The shield is too much. That's okay. Yeah, so I think I, this comp is actually pretty good. I, I'm, I'm okay with playing those units. Uh, we'll go for tank items and um, AP items, of course. I need a Shojin as well. There's a Riven. I mean, Riven doesn't do much right now. Oh, that was a Shen as well. I should have taken the Shen. I'm stupid. Riven isn't going to do much right now, but she's going to be very useful. It gives us Bruiser for the time being. Maybe we can tack into Story Weaver earlier for a little bit of tempo. Three Story Weaver is still very fine. I mean, it's just too nice. No, There's Altruist now. I can drop, drop. Play Altruist. I feel like I will do that. I will lose uh, ghostly, but honestly, I don't even care because this gives us bruiser altruist, right? It's just too good. Soraka with these items is gonna be very fine. Buy this for now. She's uh, exalted at the moment, so this is a very good comp. Now we have exalted it as well, which means we will get the extra exp every single turn. Turn, and we got it on two five. Very nice. With a, with a decent comp, right? Like I mean, I have Diana and Chen. Very good. We could also play Dragon uh, Lord. Yeah, next turn. Or next level, I'm down for that. Oh, I could just play Janna, right? Instead of Zyra, but then we lose Story Weaver. Do I care? It's just three Story Weaver. This gives us Invoker and um, Dragon Lord. Like, this seems way better. 
Nice. Okay, I, I mean, I feel like we should be very strong here, man. Or very, like, not, not that we are very strong, we are just in a very decent spot. This, this comp is gonna be, it's gonna pop off, man, I'm telling you. Oh, oh, watch. Very good. Do I play Jenna over Soraka? I can make gold. I will lose Altruist, but I get Dragon Lord. I do this because this way I can make gold, which honestly is more important than winning here. Give that to the Jenna. Nice. Shield. Nice. We can kill two more, I think, here, and then I'm just happy enough. Okay. Oh, actually, we can win this, huh? Nice. That's a good job. I didn't even have to sell my Rek'Sai. I was, that's a trigger finger right there. It happens to me way too many times. It's something that I need to pay attention to, not to sell too early. Because I tend to do that. Um, but yeah, so what level are we? Level 8 is our comp. I mean, level 8, finding a Rokan is, you know. But until we find Rokan, we can just play Soraka, actually. It's not even bad. Like, it's honestly not even bad. That would be our level 9 comp, though. Like, this is... Yeah, this is a very good level 9 comp. I mean, I can drop Galio, because I don't know... Like, it doesn't do much, right, at the moment. It gives us Bruiser, though. With, with Riven... Yeah, no, I'm not dropping Galio, man. That's a very good comp. Can I get an early Lilia or Morgana as well, man? Like, that would be so nice. Sell, sell. Uh, no, that's just tank item. I can Shojin her for now. We'll rebuild Janna later. Our main tank is gonna be Galio, so just gonna give it to Rek'Sai for now. I could level, could level, can I play something? I can play Behemoth. Playing this, not this, because uh, it still make, I can still make 40 with this, and that's decent enough. Yeah, I, I feel like we're in a good spot. We just go fast eight, maybe fast nine even from here. Okay, first augment is on three freaking six, man. Like what the hell? Thank you, Lilia. <laughs> it's okay, though. I want to play Lilia anyway. So. We'll have to thank her so that she shows up in the shop as well. You know how it works, right? That's just, that's just it. I want to play Soraka next. Heavenly Altruist on level 7. That would be my level of seven. I don't even need to buy anything else. <laughs> it's kind of insane when you think about it. Just how well all of these pieces fit together. I go level seven here. I'm a little sad that I sold my Soraka, but honestly, I, it made me make more gold at the time, so it's fine. Fated. Mythic. He's playing Sniper, is he? Zero gold. Yeah, that's all right with me. That is all right with me. Let's go this way. This guy has a Riven too, which is very scary. But probably okay, I guess. Oh, Bard as well with the Ginsu's. Maybe it's not okay. Okay, nice healing from the Diana there. That was actually very important. Ah, uh, yeah, we lose this. It's okay. Uh, it's fine. We're still very, very healthy, right? Yeah, our guy has a very good team. It's just three-story three river is so strong early on. It's insane. 
Uh, or offers you a choice of artifacts. These are not very good. These are really not very good. I mean, these I can't really use. Tricksters is the only thing I can use here, but... Okay, it gives me a Janna. I can copy my Janna, I guess. It's not very good though. Like, let's be honest with about that one, right? Gives me a bit of a backline. Yeah. Fine. Like, this guy gets freaking mana in. Like, literally, either any AP item or a tank item would have been good. And I get two gold items, which don't do anything for me. And I get a Trickster's Glass. Sad. Very, very sad. But that's RNG, man. It's okay. We got a very good start from the RNG itself, so... Nothing to complain about, I guess. Any unit I can pick up here? Not really. So we're looking for items then. Tank items now, because we are a little bit short on tank items. So Galio has a built-in Gargoyles, pretty much. I mean, Gargoyles is still pretty good on him, but he gets so much resist when he taunts that it's not that needed. I'm just gonna go D-Claw on a 3 cost. I think that's fine. I also need a good item for my backline at some point. Not sure who's gonna get the Tricksters. Well, not really sure yet. Level here. Play a Dryad, just... It's fine, I want Soraka, of course. Can I play anything else that would be good? Invoker, maybe? There's nothing here. Sage, no. Yeah, that's that's my in at the moment. It's fine, we're going level eight soon. We're gonna get our first augment. <laughs> oh, we're just gonna get our first augment, man. That's insane. Um, I need a bit more damage, I think, on my board at the moment, because we don't have that much damage. Oh, it's decent. Janna is a good unit, by the way, as well, to reroll, but not gonna play that in this game. Maybe at some point I will try it. Okay, I think we win this. Nice. Close fight, but it's... Okay, let's get the augment. Finally, man. Finally. First augment of the game. Dragon Spirit? I have a Dragon Claw. But it's, it's so late now. Gain more XP. Nico? Hero Augment. I'm not taking that. I feel like this is very good for me. Deeper Crest. Oh, that's decent. Who gets the item though? Just Rek'Sai for now. Uh, so this... Gain a random component and 12 XP now. Each After each player combat, if there are no items on your bench, gain 2 XP. Right, so, I mean, it's very late into the game to take something that gives you <laughs> gives you something every single stage. But um, honestly, the other thing that I could have taken there was the Dragon Claw stuff. And this gives me 12 XP as well, which lets me level 8 faster. So I'm kind of okay with it. Because my, my cap is at level 9. But I need to roll on level 8 to stabilize. This guy is playing the same comp as I envisioned, man. That is... That is not it. I'm contested. That's okay. I mean, he's level 6. I'm level 7, almost level 8. So, who cares? Who cares, right? <clears throat> Plus, this gives me a component, which I need anyway. Like, I can use either AP items, which I got a rod. I, or I can use tank items, so perfectly fine. Lilia gets Shojin and uh, Gumblade, probably in Rabadons, maybe, or JG or something like that. Morgana can also take those items, I anyways, so it's fine. 
You can go level eight so soon, man. Like this is, <laughs> yeah, we can go level nine fast, but I, I have to roll on eight and stabilize a little bit because everyone will be rolling on four, one, four, two and stabilizing. So I need to do that as well. Need to find Lilia. Like we need to find this comp, right? Either one of these two, but practically this comp. Uh, not, not it. Okay, some items. GS is a, is okay. It's also, get a random uh, component, two gold. A random five cost champion. Not needed. Not needed. I'm just taking this. Like this is decent. Wukong, sure. I can play the Wukong. I can also do this. Wait, I need Morello, right? So let's just do this, I think. Can I? <sighs> I got a Wukong. Two star this. Let's scout a little bit. Not rolling yet, not rolling yet. Not rolling yet. I think I'm fine. I can just go nine on four five and and be done with that. I mean my comp is decent. With Wukong in, right? Wukong was a big spike. I would love to give the items to him, probably, but Yeah, I mean, we're still very strong, man. Like, it's insane. Heavenly Emblem, 125 as well. What did he get? I think he sold, did he? Not playing these units, it's okay. I mean, I can drop the Gnar. Dryad Warden. thinking I mean I can drop the Gnar it's just Dryad and I can play Heavenly which is probably better probably better here three Heavenly right over two Dryad Dryad does nothing two Dryad yeah this exalted trade is by the way just like giga busted in my opinion especially like every game you can play around it by just composing a team and uh, and you can have a fun game like it's just it's it's absolutely okay, man. Honestly, getting a TG would be very nice here. I lose this fight. That's okay. Like, no, not too worried about this one, right? We're gonna go Giga Nine on four five and roll it down, and then get and then hit our whole team, which will be this. Dragon Lord. Could play Dragon Lord. I mean, three Dragon Lord doesn't do anything, though, right? It's not really good. Four Dragon Lord is very good. Uh, uh, this guy beats me for sure. This guy also beats me. Yeah, it's fine. I'll lose one more turn, man. I can even lose until 5 5 or 5 1, sorry and um, just roll there if I really want to because I'm 74 HP I'm just a little worried about units getting out of the pool units that I need so we'll see yeah, as I said this guy beats me it's okay I mean, could have been a better loss, not gonna lie. For sure, could have been a better loss. Okay, what do we get here? A loon adds a completed item to each champion. Oh, there's a Morgana. Can I get that? With a tear. Morgana with the tear and our Nashers. I mean, that's just so nice. There's also a Rakan with a JG, so. It's taken. Okay, get this thing or that thing sunfire sunfire is fine is there a, is there gloves no there isn't 
Okay, that's taken. I'm just taking this then. Tank items, fine. I level here, I feel like I have to. Okay. Who do I duplicate? Just Morgana. I don't want to go below 10. I need to slam this, but I don't want Godbreaker. Give this to Diana, I think. Okay. Yeah, I have to roll on 5-1. I really need to stabilize now, though. I really need to start stabilizing. There's the Janna. Wonder if uh, Hui is better for now with these items. Sure. Because this gives me, it takes me above 20 as well. And I will need to rebuild Janna anyway, right? Also, it gives me a better chance to hit Janna too. This guy has Lilia too. Like, this is what I was afraid of, basically. Is that my units will be gone from the pool. Uh, he hits Rokan as well. Okay, we roll it down here. Started out as a very, very good game and turned sour really fast, right? For losing four fights like this in a row. Maybe I should have stabilized on 8 as I set out to be, but we still have 33 HP, we're fine. We're gonna be fine, we're gonna hit. I mean, I'm level 9, I, I, I am bound to hit. Um, and this is the other thing where it's like, I kind of wanted these items on, on this guy. Right. Oh, we still don't have our third augment, by the way. Okay, that's decent. Shall I prove them right? Into the dark. Okay, I mean, I'm definitely playing this, right? If I'm given for free. Uh, okay, let's fix our team. I guess. This is a, a TG. I have a TG, nice. Okay, so this goes on to Lilia for now, I guess. These items on her. Might be able to win this. I'm not gonna get the EXP, but that's okay. I'm not winning this, man. Okay, that is very bad, losing that fight like this. 20 HP. So I can't change it a little bit, right? but it's still fine, I think, in the long run. Dummy. That's not very good. So who gets this then? There's the Zaya Rakan. I can drop this for this. Just probably fine. Um, man, Arif, how much mana do you have? 60, 50. 
90. And I have to slam double redemption, which is a little bit scuffed. Give that to him, I think. Uh, I don't love this, I'm not gonna lie. I don't have a front line at the moment. Still need to keep rolling. But I mean, we should be fairly strong. Surely we're strong enough now, right? I don't know if I can go 10 from this spot. Probably not. Need to hit Lilia too. But like 3 Altruist, 3 Dragon Lord, 3 Sage. 4 Dragon Lord would be very nice as well. Ghostly, Heavenly, Invoker, everything, right? Oh, Trash to Treasure. Dragon Lord Crown gives us 4 Dragon Lord. This gives us like a million. Um, I mean, 3. I can get three Orn items from this. Sounds pretty good. I'm gonna take this. It might be a mistake, but I, f I feel like it's pretty good. I can give the Ginsu's over to her. We get four Dragon Lord. I need to keep rolling and hit. Uh, not this, but. Exalted Story Weaver. I, mean, I really want Rakan 2 and Lilia 2 or Riven 2 or something, right? Like, I need more frontline, is the thing. <clears throat> we do get the stun now, which is very, very nice from Dragon Lord. This 4 Dragon Lord is a big, big juicer. It's very big, actually, especially late game. You stun the enemy whole board, right? Okay, if I hit two star Lilia, I'm just gonna chill and go ten, I think. But even now, I might be able to go that, go and do that. This, I think, give it to Lilia. And we have a stacked back line, and then we just need to get our front line in order. This is why I wanted Galio so much, because Galio would be my main tank. This is big. If I if I go Galio, who do I drop? I mean, the only thing I can drop is Rakan, but that's Dragon Lord or this guy, right? I, I mean, level 10, I could play the Galio, but I'm so far off from that. Don't want to go below Tangled. I, I'm not, never going Wukong 3, though, so I'm going to do this instead. Because if I get a Galio 2, it is a Galio 2, right? So. This guy is pretty strong. Umbral with the Zanyas on the guy. I wonder how he got the... How did he... Hmm. How did he get the Orn item? Oh, I got an Orn item as well. Never mind. That's... F okay. Nice. That was from one of the encounters, right? Orn encounter. I'm just... I'm just stupid. Okay, we win this fight. That's very good, actually. So maybe we do go 10 on 6-1. On Play the Galio. Gives us Bruiser. Gives us more front line. Kind of down. 52. 52. Ah, I mean, these guys are just way too strong, though. Way too strong. Hmm. Wukong, very good items. He swapped sides on the bard. It's a ghost fight, so lucky. Very lucky on us, or for us. If this wasn't the ghost fight, I would be in big trouble, I feel like. Okay, we can definitely go 10 now. We get so much XP from Exalted and then from Slamming. 
as well. 48. We get gold here. We play this immediately at 10. Like, uh, and then I don't have gold to roll, but it's fine. I get an extra unit on my board and I get bruiser, which is at 10, it's a thousand HP, right? On my whole board, essentially. Like a hundred HP per unit. So I have 10 units, so it's a thousand HP. I hope that makes sense. I'm sure it does. Oak Age. I actually really, really like the Exalted trait. It keeps the game so flexible if you want to, right? It's only the Morgana. Wukong again. Soraka. Oh, TG is very good though. Gives us more frontline here. Just give that to this guy and be done with that. Okay, we just keep rolling now, donkey rolling. Essentially, I don't lock the shop for this Soraka because yeah, she's not as important as either one of these two. This gives me more frontline, this gives me more damage, right? This just, like, two-star Soraka does nothing, pretty much. I mean, it gives me more heavenly bonus, but honestly, it's fine. Okay, my Wukong just died to the Syndra. Alright, maybe we can kill here. Should be able to. Oh my god, very close fight, but we win, so that's good. We win, right? Hello? <laughs> oh my god, that was way too exciting, I guess. Um, another Wukong. Still no Lilia. And this guy is hogging Lilias. Not really, it's just the three. Oh, it's actually just one. What am I talking about? Um, I need to swap sides. I think. Maybe like this. My, my Wukong is in a bit of a crappy position there. It's fine. He can walk up. Get the taunt off of Galio. Okay, your backline is almost dead, buddy. Oh my god, what just happened to his team? Wait a second. Am I just giga chatting it? Sure looks like it. Nice. I don't even need to donkey roll now. I can wait one more turn to get some more money. Um, this is in ah yeah so there are, that's that's why there are so many Lilias are out of the pool right like five Lilias six with mine so one of these might die now might I have to swap back because of the Caitlyn don't want to get sniped by the Caitlyn immediately terrible items on my TGs unfortunately but such is life that's uh, RNG. We will get the Galio taunt off, and then we get the Dragon Lord stun off, or you know, something along those lines. This guy is strong. My Lilia is dead. They are gonna snipe my back line. I don't think I win this. No, I don't. So that's a problem because there are still Lilias. Ah, <laughs> oh, out of the pool, man. I was hoping one of them would die. Emblems, this, these are not good for me, unfortunately. At all. Like, there's no tank item or anything that I could take. No unit I can take. Okay. Morgana. Doesn't do much for me, unfortunately. Other Wukong. Hmm. Hmm. I think that's better. But this guy is really strong as well.
Can we win this? No, doesn't look like it. I mean, man, that was unlucky. We didn't hit our units at all. That's a nice finisher move. Maybe it's a top three. It is a top three, so it's going to be a YouTube video. Um, many mistakes made that game, but it was still fine, and I really enjoyed the Exalted trait, right, and how we can just build our team around it. If you guys enjoyed that video, please leave a like and a comment for the algorithm, and consider subscribing, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.